you look kind of friendly. Hi, mister. How you doing? What is up, guys? It's your boy and welcome to Poppy Playtime Chapter 1. This is for the Xbox. Um, they released this a long time ago. Um, I'm barely getting to it right now. Um, but... Mind you, it is 3 in the morning for me at, the, at this time that I am recording this. <sighs> I'm not ready. Anyway. Chapter 1, A Tight Squeeze. As an ex-employee of Playtime Co., you finally returned to the factory many years after everyone within disappeared. And we have this goofy motherfucker to look at right now, but without any further ado, let's get into it. Also, I just want to point out, I'm waiting for chapters 2 and, th and 3 to come out. You are so. about to see the most incredible doll ever invented. Okay. Her name is Poppy, and she is the first truly intelligent doll in the world. Is she? A little girl can talk to her. Poppy gives her answers. She is the first doll actually able to have a conversation with a child. I feel like that's what Elon Musk wants to do. Just watch. Okay. Poppy's as lovable as a real girl, and she talks like one, too. Hi, my name is Poppy. I love you. Um. Can you help me polish my shoes? Okay. Why, of course, Poppy. Just like a real girl, Poppy always wants to look her best. Perfect. Thank you. Her hair is sturdy and won't come out when you brush it, and smells just like a Poppy flower. I've, wait, are Poppy flowers even like real? Say, Poppy? I'm a real girl. What's the time? Playtime! And sure. If you've ever wanted to see how all of the nation's favorite toys were created, Playtime Co. is now offering factory tours at just $2.99 a person. Ooh, okay. An entire hour in the most magical toy factory on Earth. That's what like are you three waiting for? Come 41 for each person. Oh, oh nah. Oh no, okay, give me some into guys. Oh no, I'm cooked. <laughs> Am I dead now? Okay. Everyone thinks the stab disappeared ten years ago. We'll stay here. Find the flower. I'm sorry. Vintage poppy commercial? Huh? No no. <laughs> oh no, it's bad. Can I it moves so smoothly around the world and around the world. I'm sorry. Um, welcome. El El Sprint. <laughs> That's a slow run. Eat healthy like broad. Poppy. Playtime Co. Cafeteria recommends a daily intake of 4,000 calories. Big motherfucker, bruh. Alright. Welcome. Bumble cat. Uh, what if I knew the code already? Just an easy guess. Oh, damn. All right. <laughs> Puppy wants to play. I don't want to play. I'm good. What am I supposed to do? No. Oh. But uh, I mean, it only makes sense. Hi. My name is Leif Pierre, and I'm the head of innovation here at the Playtime Co. Toy Factory. Okay. If you're seeing this, then you're trespassing. Yeah, we play this little tape on loop whenever we close the factory for the day. So, trespasser, just to make you aware, while we pride ourselves primarily on our high-quality toys and excellent child care, we also pride ourselves on our security. For example, this facility is full of hidden motion triggers, which, once set off, We'll turn on the factory's emergency alarms and directly contact the authorities. And oh fuck! In that case, let me get out of here. Aspects of our security system. No spoilers. I want to get out. So, you've got my warning. Oh, fuck it's me. Not too late to turn around. I just hope that you're certain whatever you're doing is worth it. I don't know what I'm doing here. I don't. I. Oh. Um. What? Just achievements? 
What? That's crazy. I didn't even realize there was even achievements here. Can I go in? Okay. Uh, green, pink, yellow, red. Green, pink, yellow, red. Okay. Um. What is that supposed to do? Oh, you don't look so good. Oh, yeah, you don't look so good. How do I crouch? <gasps> oh, bees crouch? Oh, no. That's gonna be a horrible. Oh, no. <coughs> Pookie bot. Okay. <laughs> Huggy wuggy! <laughs> Sorry. Um, security. Wait. There's a code up there. Green, pink, yellow, red. Let's try that. Green, pink, yellow, red. Any faster now? Let's do the four day one. Alright. Green, pink, yellow, red. Hey, let's do this. All right, cool. Um, oh, Ron's missing his head. Grab pack training. Oh, cool. All right. Fair enough. Oh. Oh, okay, he just decapitates his co-worker. Wires conductive, used for rewiring. Oh, cool. Thank you. Thank you for letting me use your grab bag responsibility. 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 Oh my god, I'm having a stroke. Responsibility. Oh, there it goes. Responsibility. What is this? Achievement. Playtime co approved. Oh. Yeah. Oh, cool. Oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> Can't do that right here? <gasps> no. -uh. I can't get out of here, okay. Wonderful. Hello, you ugly motherfucker. Oh my god, you're huge. That's what she said. P but not to me, okay. Um, can I? <sighs> High five. <laughs> if I just. <laughs> okay. You were not holding that key earlier. Where did you get that from? Did you pull that out, out of your ass? Oh. You don't got an ass. Okay. Well. I'd like to have it, please. Thank you. Um. What am I supposed to do here? Oh. Remember. Do be kind to others, show up on time, not hide behind doors to scare Leif Pierre. Don't stay past 8 p.m. Misuse comp co co company time. Tamper with machinery. Enter innovation wing without authorization. Okay, lovely c community, I guess. So, what the fuck was that? Oh, nah. Okay. 
And he's gone. Well, this is not good. Uh, where's the big motherfucker at? Okay, can we do this now? Check my surroundings. Oh, this cafeteria. Can I enter here? Damn. Missed opportunity. Alright, and we're just gonna... Uh-huh. Right back out the door. Uh-huh, yep, okay. <laughs> Alright, we're out of here, boys. We're gonna... I can't leave. Okay. Make a friend. I don't want to be his friend. He's scary. Please don't scare me. Was that supposed to be a jump scare? Ah! This game's a joke. It ain't, it ain't even scary. I'm living through this. What is this? What is this room? Decapitated toys. Decapitated bee. Fumble cat. Baby head. Can I grab that? Yeah! Get fucked, bozo! <laughs> Yellow consent tape. Okay, uh, consent tape where? Don't know. Apparently, Drake doesn't have one of those. Oh! Alright, fair enough. Uh, let's see. Red, blue, yellow, green. Alright, fair enough. Uh, well, there's yellow. I didn't find the orange tape. Is that something I was supposed to be looking for the entire time down here? I think I should be looking for it right now. No? Yes? No, maybe so? Is that right there? The orange tape? No, this yellow. That, that. Huh? Where's all my English today? Oh my god, it's broken. Um. Well. Okay, I feel like that was supposed to be a jump scare entirely, but I could see him. Peeking. That's just okay. I feel like I'm supposed to find that along the way. No. Yeah. By the time we get up here, he's gonna close it, right? Hi. How are ya? Okay. <laughs> All right. All right, buddy. Find a orange tape or something like that. Where's it at? Yeah, let's find one of those. They in here? They're in here. Where are they? Found it by now, no? Tape, 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 tape. Found this an orange tape. Where would I be hiding right now? In a box, no. In a cat, no. In a baby head, no. Um. Let's 
gonna have a stroke by the time I'm done with this game. <laughs> That's an achievement. <laughs> Use responsibly. It's interesting. <laughs> That's funny. Okay. Um, I feel like there's. Was there a team down here? I don't think so. No. Can't be. It has to be around here. Another achievement. Rich and Avery. Watch the security camera. Rich and Avery VHS tape. I feel like they might add chapters 2 and 3 on here. I'm hoping they would. Because that would be actually pretty interesting. I'm not, I'm not even going to lie with y'all. That would be pretty cool. Seeing chapters 2 and 3 on here. Ow. Okay, uh... Wait, can we try that other door that's back here? There's another door back here, I know that. Had the blue and red hand. Oh, shit. Okay, never mind then. Good, you can't do that then, I guess. I don't know. Anyway. Hi, Huggy. Someone need a hug? I promise I won't bite. Ow. Wee. Wee. Alright, it goes there. It really goes there. Colors. Oh, beat a crouch. Okay, I accidentally forgot. I'm sorry. Wee. Nice and if what if I just complete the circle complete the circle? No. Nah. Is there a way that you're supposed to do it specifically or something? Or what's going on? Oh. Xbox? Oh, got the frames up. <laughs> Power. 
Hey, little OST. Okay, I like this. Playtime Co. Fostering Happiness Adopting Orphan Today. The Playtime Co. Fostering Adoptive Care in in Innovative Strives to Create Permensary in the Lives of Orphan Children by Recruiting Adoptive fi Foster Parents within our own organization. With we encourage all Playtime Co. employees to take part in our mission by fostering or adopting an orphan child. Participating employees may be eligible for additional benefits. These, this innovative helps children not only from in the Midwest region, but also orphans around the world. Every child deserves the chance at a new life. How is this even legal? Tapes. So, Stella, what made you want to work at the Playtime Co. factory? Playing with toys when I was young. Okay. So magical. I could go straight from my bedroom floor to anywhere in the world. It was such a great feeling. And being able to work at a toy factory, somewhere that can provide kids with that same experience, that's a pretty great feeling too. Sometimes though, I really, really wish I could go back. To being a kid, I mean. And it's weird, because adults are just kids, but older. I don't think yeah. anyone ever really feels like an adult. But your body just gets older and older, and then you die. What? Poof! <laughs> Human bodies just can't stay young forever. There's things, though. Like some trees that can stay alive even while being way older than a person. Where is this going? The oldest people to ever live are still younger than those. So I guess everyone is always young relative to something. Right? Huh? Alright, I think we're getting a little off track. A little? Bitch, we were off track entirely. Is that an achievement, Xbox? <laughs> of course it is. <laughs> Alright. It was, an, it, was an, it was an achievement, of course. <laughs> Let's uh, wait. Oh, damn. Okay. Well, I wanted to not do that. Try to see if I could just skip past it or something. Okay. Oh, wait. Then. I don't think it'll let me do it. <laughs> Alright, fair enough. Heavy ass footsteps. Dum 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 dum. I don't think Huggy Wuggy will hear you, man. I think he'll fear you because of how big your footsteps are. I get that thing. Hold on, wait. What if I just... Hold on, well, let me test this out. <gasps> no. -uh. Oh, I found the cheat code. <laughs> Beat this thing on full speed. <laughs> Can I make this?
Anyway, make a friend, 1960. Our founder, Elliot Ludwig, was a visionary. He set the stage for all Playtime Co.'s greatest fates. Yeah, all the amazing things he, that he created. The make a friend machine is one of the most creative, impressive, and advanced. It is solely responsible for nearly every Playtime Co. toy sold on the market to the day. All it needs is to be fed the proper parts, and it will then paint a simple of the toy all on its own. Gone is the need of complex sorting or back breaking labor. The machine can do all that and more. Okay. That's inspecting? No. <gasps> we created Humble cat. He glorious. Can I have him? Bumble cat is mine. I want Bumble cat. We have Bumble cat. I click. In a way, that's an achievement. <laughs> Assemble and obtain the cat B twenty. I like Bumble cat more. But at least without a toy. I just made him. Can I keep him? I guess. I do get him back though, right? What? No. -uh. Stairway to hell. Caution: Do not enter. I'm staff. I could be like ex staff or something like that. I don't know. Scary void. All right, fair enough. <laughs> uh. Nope. 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 Oh, ew, what are you? Ew, what are you? Hi. You look kind of friendly. Hi, Mister. How you doing? Controller. Ow, hold on, wait. Ow. Okay, so we just counter him or something? Where are we supposed to go? Oh, pfft, duh. Okay. He can't follow us in here, can he? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh no. Oh, nope. nope. Oh, please do not be in front of me, please. Oh, dear God. I'm poop. Oh, God. I'm scared to look behind me. 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 Can I go down here? Big again! Good, 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 good. Oh, dear God. I feel like I'm just running slow. Oh. Oh, 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 no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Why am I running so- Ooh. Okay, 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 what do I do? What the fuck do I do? Is this- Can I pull it? What do I do? What? 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 Narrow escape. Escape from Huggy Wuggy. Human? What the fuck? Um, okay. 
A? I'm so confused. TV. TV. Cause they tip it that. Let's watch. Movie time, people. Final log. Simulation. <laughs> Experiment one zero zero six. The prototype. Coordination and cooperation is evidently within his skill set, okay. as well as the skill set of all other experiments of his type. Though still missing, today's events are no doubt in relation to him. His absence was a flaw in the scientific process, which should have under no circumstances been left unaccounted for. What's happening in background? That's why I'm making this log, so that the same mistake won't be made twice. Any future experiments will need to be contained and disposed of in a secure location. I'm not worried about myself. One breakthrough and I'll be back. We okay, must forge onwards in the name of science. Whether those oh. who are beneath us understand it or not. End of... Oh, he's dead. 100% he's dead. Alright, fair enough. What? The prototype. That's the prototype? Watch the final VHS tape. Okay. Go back, run, turn, around, stop, danger, no, run. <gasps> they killed Bubble Cat! <laughs> My sweet prince, it's okay. Oh, they killed Bron. Killed the quick bot. And then the homie, Bumble Cat. But I feel like we must go down here, because there's no way back. Think about it. I don't think there is. Pause. This isn't a factory. How big is this place? How much money do they even have? I hate the music that's already playing. Okay. Alright, fair enough. What is this? Okay, cool. Oh, you're creepy. Who are you? Oh. Uh. You opened my case. I did. Okay. Time to play. Complete the game. Okay. Playtime. Not bad. It made me face but my controller, but it's alright. I enjoyed it. Can't wait for chapters 2 and 3 to, to be released here on the Xbox console, hopefully. Or soon. I'm not too sure. But I would definitely be playing those other two chapters. Hopefully they do it. I'm not too sure if they will. I'm hoping. Pink noise. Based on the work of the original Puppet Playtime team. Also, they sold the rights to Chapter 1. Poppy, Nola, Clope, Stella, Graber, Female, K. Well, alright. Augusto Quinteros. I said that's so white. Oh my god. They have it in Spanish port and Portuguese? That's crazy. Wow, look at all those playtesters. Special thanks. Dan McLaughlin. Thank you for playing. No, thank you for scaring me to death around 4.18 in the morning. has been Puppy Playtime Chapter 1. If you guys want me to do chapter chapters 2 and 3, let me know down in the comments and I will do my best to do it. But that's gonna do it for this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed and as always, shall see y'all in the next one. Peace.
I'll seek you out for you.